Starting a new company can be a difficult journey. And for as much fun as we're having, there are still those waves of doubt. There are many questions. Like how are we going to make this a business? Is anyone going to like our show? Are we out of our minds? I was having another one of those days. And then, this happened. <laughs> Getting ready to go to the beach today, uh, do some intel we've collected. We think that uh, the ginger beard man is at the beach today. He's elusive. That is not an easy person to track down. Um, he goes into hiding quite a bit. Uh, wish us luck. Hopefully we'll find him. Get some Kirk Schaff. How are you this evening? Your beard's looking good. I, I, I Wait, have so a question. Let me tell you, I, I, no, no, I, 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 Ladies first. Go ahead. I mean, I was driving the way home. Todd asked me over for dinner, so I take a right turn. I, I didn't ask. You, you just showed up. I didn't no, ask. I took a right. Driving on the way home. Babe, you today, don't even wash the hair. Driving on the way home, and I was like, all day I was just getting at my beard. Oh, oh like you're pulling on it? Oh, it's fine itches. Isn't there? Well, it's just it's scratching like it's. And it felt I mean, good. I was just kind of good. Well, yeah, I was driving in the car, and the flakes are oh, flying. Oh, the dent. Well, shit. and it brings us. It brings us to an interesting question, because I mean, if we are going to make this an actual company, we we've, we've got to, I guess, sell something. What kind of product? Beard conditioner. Well, like beard conditioner, shampoos, <laughs> oils, I don't know. Merchandise will do hats and shirts. What the product is, is it going to be creams? Is it going to be, you know? You guys need to go to the new barber shop, and you need to watch what they do. And you need to ask them, because they're barbers, and that's what they do. They shave Oh, face, that's a good interview, a research interview. And you, yeah, and you say, smart. what? There's a reason. Yeah, yeah, she's smart. What, what? There's a reason. There's oh, a what reason you I use, actually love her. Of? Huh? Right. What do you recommend for me? Do you, how often should you shampoo it? How what, often should you shampoo it? Is my oh, idea. Sorry, I said that first. Whatever. I'll edit it so I said it first, actually. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but I'm okay. Lucky guy. I'm kind of excited uh, to see what the uh, salt water at the beach is going to do for our beards. Um, you know how it like, texturizes the hair? So maybe it's going to texturize the beard. They may even grow twice in size, like twice, double in size. They might double in size. And tell them. Oh, I know. Well, I was my dad. A I, didn't of my dad. I didn't know this. There's a picture of my dad. Uh, he's at, we're at a zoo. He's behind bars, like inside at one of the cages, acting like a gorilla. He's got overalls on. Big beard, long hair. Awesome. You see that? that was his inspiration to grow the beard. Yeah. And then... Everything else stemmed from that. But he... Oh, wow, great. Uh, well, because we, we talked about the logo being a beard. He goes, get find that picture. I know, do you press, have it, though? You find, see? My mom might have it. Find the picture and then use his beard as the wow. beard. Or you, you can even use this the outline guy. of his, his features. Like and yes, his, yeah, his whole like, like the shape from of here. His face. Yeah, the yeah. shape of his face with oh, the beard, man. Like you know that you should have a conversation with that's him about. It's ridiculous. Yes. You're not. No, that's I, not I, a real phone. No, I think that it's, it's, a, it's a toy phone. Got a little line. Listen, listen to me. That he does, his he does beard, this all the time. I, I don't. I don't. There's, I don't, there's no one on the other line. He. That's not even a real phone. He doesn't want to. I'm gonna punch him in the beard. You can't tell him. You want to talk? No, I'm not gonna tell. I'm not gonna say it. I think he. I, I think. Just arrived at the beach. Put my eyes open for the ginger beard man. Hopefully we can find him soon. Let's go get him. The ginger beard man. So, um, I understand there's been a ginger beard man sighting. There has been, and we're. Is he in the is he in the local area? We're sitting next to him. Is he is he he's right behind me, isn't he? Yes, he is. We found him. This is the uh, ginger beard man. Um, <laughs> hey, Crystal. Hi. Hi. How are you? Her? Good. How are you? Good. Good. She has a good memory too. Yeah. Do you prefer a man with a beard or without a beard, and why? With beard. Oh. <laughs> Why like, do you prefer like a man a, with a beard? Like a dirty grizzly bear, sexy kind of look for me. That's I'm, what that's what I say. That's what I exactly yeah. what I say. Does, say your finger? Yes. Does your uh, husband? Uh, he has a beard when he can't have a beard. What, what? He's military. Oh, oh he's military. Yeah. Oh, they're, but they're probably he really goes strict. Away, like, or goes on leave or something like that. 
he's always grown it out. I want to know more. I want to know um, who was the first beard crush? Oh, like, oh man. Well, you were your first. But... Anyways, carry on. Yeah, but you wore that shirt, so. <laughs> <laughs> I told him not to wear that shirt! <laughs> he didn't want to listen! <laughs> I want to give you an official high five uh, because I guess high fives. I don't. People still do high fives. I, I don't know. Uh, if you have a beard, you can give high fives, even if it's not cool. Oh, God. Uh, was there, it doesn't have to be, but um, was there a beard crush? Maybe there was, maybe there wasn't. Maybe there was like a scruff crush. For some reason, like, yeah, David Beckham kind of comes to mind. He's yeah. got, sometimes he's got that scruff and Me it's too. like, oh, yeah, damn. Oh, yeah, damn. Yeah. Um, the greatest trick that Ginger Beer Man ever pulled was convincing the world that he didn't exist. Well, he did exist, and we found him. And then, poof, just like that, he was gone. So, big bummer. Uh, unexpected twist in the Ginger Beard Man um, interview. You could tell once he realized uh, we wanted to talk to him on film that... Uh, he was confused. You know, after trying to explain, you know, we're just here to talk to you. We're not here to harm you. Uh, the original ginger beard man. He he ran. He up and he ran. And we lost him. Nowhere to be found. <sighs> Great news. I just got off a call. I had some intel. More intel come in. I found another ginger beard man. Unbelievable. Uh, I thought it was like Yeti and Bigfoot. It turns out there are many of them. I had no idea. Uh, Max, thanks once again for being here today. Is it true that only another ginger can call a ginger a ginger? Like, what can I call you? Can I call you red? Strawberry shortcake? Bitch, Fire face. Right? Oh, I wish that was my real name. Right, what if I called you like Ginger but with a J? You know, like uh, <laughs> what if when I said it to you, yeah. and I say, "Hey, Ginger," but you clarify with a J. Yeah, right? and I don't have to clarify. You just know, come from me. Yeah. It's like it, it kind of starts with a J. Yeah, I'd say that your spelling was incorrect, probably. So just you know, it's like kind of a VIP thing for me. You know what I mean? Did you just eat an orange popsicle? <laughs> no. So, oh, so it frightens you? Yeah. Not so much frightened, but not keen on the orange color because of the teasing and mocking I got as a right, child. Because of your condition. Uh, do you <laughs> feel uh, prejudice on a daily basis? No, not on a daily basis, but when I was a child, most certainly. Yeah. Got yeah. made fun of a lot. Just carrot top. And Which doesn't make any sense because the carrot top is green. Do yeah. you have a fiery temper? Temper? Yeah. Most certainly. Yeah. yeah. I'm one of the most angry individuals I know. Yeah. Are you related to Satan? I think so. I was actually conceived at 666 Ranch Avenue Penthouse. I was a hell child growing up and being a rebellious individual. Do you or do you not have a soul? I don't think I do. But I don't think you do either. If you could somehow figure out a way to have a normal beer, have a normal life, like, would you celebrate that? You know, would you a party? You know, like maybe have a pool party? It would be more than a pool party. Lots of booze. Uh, certainly. Uh, Max, thanks once again for being here today. Uh, one last question. Does the carpet match the drapes? Oh, certainly. It does. Yes. Join us next week on Bearder Than Me as we continue our search for great beards, friendly people, and the right path to make this a successful company. Thanks for watching.